So I've opened up iPhoto and I want to gather up the images that I want to use. The easiest way to do it is to make an album. So we've chosen Halloween. So I'm going to make a new album called Halloween. I already have a whole bunch of albums in here. So to make a new one, I'm just going to click on the plus sign. And I'm going to call this Halloween 2010. Now it's not quite Halloween 2010, so I don't actually have any images yet. I had this image selected, so it put it in there, and I actually don't want that in there, so I'm just going to hit delete. And it did not delete my photo, it just deleted it out of the album. And I'm going to do a search on Halloween and see what comes up from years past. And apparently I have no keywords for Halloween. Okay, so we'll go in and we'll do, we can do events, and I can take a quick look here and see here's some Halloween pictures so I can just grab this and I can drag and drop it into my Halloween which went down here just place those in there now it says that there's seven photos in there keep going oh, there's some Halloween ones here so Halloween 29 so that's good that's a good amount of photos and if I click on my album now I can see all the photos that I have in here so I'm going to use them all. I'm just going to make copies of them all and then I can weed through them later. So I need to just drag and drop these out of iPhoto onto my hard drive. And I want to select all. And I can either, you know, try and drag like a big giant box around them or I can just hit Command A and then that will select all my photos. Now you notice they're all selected. Okay, and I'm just going to slide this over so that I can actually see my Halloween folder right there. And I'm going to click and drag. And you must click and drag on a thumbnail. So my cursor is on the thumbnail. I'm just going to grab it and look, it says it's got the number 29. And I'm going to drag it and my this folder gets highlighted and I'm going to drop it. And now it's copying and it's just making copies. So I haven't pulled anything out of iPhoto. Everything's still good in iPhoto. I can now close or quit out of iPhoto. And now I have copies of all of those images onto my hard drive. And if I need to further organize them by page, I can do that. So let's just go ahead and take a look. Um, maybe I want to make like Ninja Turtle. So I'll make a folder and then I'm going to grab all of my Ninja Turtle pictures and I'm going to drag and drop those down into my Ninja Turtle folder. Okay. And then I could go ahead and make like Darth Vader. There's a Darth Vader costume in here. So I'm going to take Darth Vader and I'm going to do the same thing. And get Darth Vader all copied over. You have to actually click and drag on the thumbnail. Okay, and now I'm ready to go.